Hi guys, just another video. Uh, yeah, just doing my thoughts on Iron Man 3 trailer that's coming out in 2013. Um, it's coming out April or May, everybody keeps saying, but there's a fisher date, it's coming out May. I think it's a worldwide release, so a certain cinemas will get it earlier, so yeah, especially Europe and thing, whatever. So, anyway, so saw the trailer today, like, um, I just came back work um so sold it and it looks good it's different um you know i hope it'd, it'd be better than part two because i didn't really enjoy part two and it came that stupid year um anyway um i hope it'd be a little bit better for the first one i still like the first one i still remember it, uh, seeing it four years ago when i first moved into this new flight well it's not new anymore but before it's new, so uh, this one's more. This one's more epic. This one, and th this looks like it's gonna be the last one of Iron Man and Tony Stark, and you know, um, and uh, obviously we got Avengers two coming out, and the Dark uh, and Just League two thousand fifteen. With some, you know, if the apocalypse does come, <laughs> um, so yeah, um, I saw the trailer. You know, it's more. Uh, it's more epic, a little more darker. Um, it's showing how, you know, how, you know, how Iron Man Tony Stark is coping with his life as a superhero, and, you know, you know, saving the world. And we got another villain, um, Mandarin, uh, played by Ben Kingsley. Uh, the, another issue is, uh, you know, Mandarin is a, he's Chinese. He's a Chinese villain, a, a bad guy, but Ben Kingsley, he's not Chinese, he's like, you know, uh, you know, uh, a British actor. Um, he's like, you know, Asian, mixed race, I don't know what the hell fuck he is, but, um, I don't know, I think, you know, he might pull off as Mandarin, you know, playing, you know, Iron Man's main villain. But uh, I don't know. I don't know how it's, how it's gonna work. But the, the trade does look promising. You know. You know this is gonna be the last one. And you know he's got a different suit this time round. Um, and it's gonna be more harder than the other last two movies. Um, so yeah. But it does look promising. It looks different. It looks more darker. Uh, it's more epic. Uh, let's see, we see. I don't know what's gonna happen in this one, so you never know. The film hasn't been released yet, so you know, it's gonna be released next year. Uh, but yeah, though, it looks um, yeah, it looks promising. So, this is gonna be the last one, and I, I knew this is gonna be you know, the final chapter for Iron Man, you know, the final movie for. I think the first one's great. Second one's crap. This one better be good than the other two. So yeah, and Robert Downey Jr. as Iron Man Tony Stark. I'm still a bit iffy, you know, you know he's playing as a character, but you know he did an okay job in the last two movies. So but this time it's gonna be the final uh, film with Iron Man. So it looks like obviously. So yeah. Um. Yeah, I can't wait. Um. Uh, Wesker, don't do that! Damn it, Wesker. Um, I know, I just keep saying, um, I don't know what to say. Um, yeah. We'll just have to wait next to you, you know, do a free review. You know, the apocalypse does come and does not come next year, so get to see this movie next year. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it goes, I don't know. Alright, guys, this is my thoughts on Iron Man 3, um, coming to us 13. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Peace.